Yeah, um, you know, it's a difficult game. We, we played three games in a week. And uh, so um, I think that you can feel that out of the guys and to, to get a, a win in a, in a clean sheet is super important. Um, so we knew it was going to be a game like in this, progress. just grind out, win. I don't think we had our best stuff tonight, but, you know, we, we, we dug it out. We'll start off with questions here in the room. Will Conwell. All right, Steve, how important is it to get these three points going into the last real break you guys are going to have uh, before going into the, the sort of final run of the season? Yeah, it's super important. Um, and, uh, you know, we want to keep the momentum going that we have. And I think that this win was about points, but it was, I, I think of it as the momentum that we're playing, that we're playing with and um, we're looking up the table now and we're instead of looking down. And I think that's a big, big step for us going into the last six games. And you're going to be quite busy during those six games, but what do you do with this, uh, you know, week off, uh, a rarity this year? Yeah, I mean, I think it's about rest, and and I think it's about guys getting in the gym, strengthening their bodies, and then um, then the week after is is back on, you know, focusing on soccer. So, um, you know, it's a time for us to rest our minds more than anything as well, because you're as you said, there's three games in a week, first week back. Um, so it's about the de decompression for me and and the guys this first week off. Thank you. All right, we'll continue um, the press conference virtually. All right, we're going to take questions off over here with Grant Little. Jill, can you hear us? Yeah, can you hear me? Yep, I'll kick it, I'll kick it to you. OK, go ahead, Grant Little. Hi, Steve. Congrats on the uh, clean sheet and the win. I was wondering if you could talk just a little bit about how the player's statement came to fruition from the Timbers in support of the Thorns and what the team has identified as necessary steps to keep reform and conversations going in the right direction. Well, um, you know, as soon as that happened, you know, we were all reaching out to our friends uh, on the Thorns um, and offering support. And, uh, you know, I want to thank Eric Williamson and, the, and the, our players union for the support that they gave us and helping us draft a statement that was um, our, that, that reflected our feelings because, you know, we are standing in solidarity with the players in the NWSL. And, um, you know, I think that we're looking forward to, if it's possible, sitting down with the Thorns, with all of us Timbers, and first of all, listening to them with empathy and then, you know, trying to learn as male players, you know, how we can be allies and, uh, and we want to hear their stories. We want to be, um, you know, men in our locker room who who stand up for for women's players you know and and all the players in the nwsl next we'll go to sam stiller hello uh steve uh congrats on the win uh today uh portland uh the timbers and your back line they've conceded you know just five goals in your past eight games um, what's been some of the differences that you've been seeing on the back line uh, during this run? Steve, could you hear that from Sam? Nope. Sam, go ahead. Steve, can you hear me now? You can hear him? Nope. Okay. Um, Sam, can you go ahead and write your question in and I will relay it real quick, please? Sorry about that, Steve. Yes, one moment. Um, in the meantime, any last questions for Steve? Okay, Sam's question is, Portland has conceded just five goals in their past eight games. What's been some of the differences you've seen on the back line? Well, I think it's just a team-wide effort, truly. And then, you know, certainly our back line is performing um, and I'm able to get a couple saves. So, you know, we're in a, we're in a great run of form when it counts. And, um, you know, we take pride in, in defending well. I take pride in being there for my team. And, you know, I felt like I've done that for the Timbers since I've been here. And um, today was another example. So, we, we, you know, we're, we're, we're out there, we're battling, and, and we feel good.